all heard that hard work will bring the greatest rewards. That's especially true for one Rutland man who came to the U.S. in pursuit of the American dream. NBC 5's Adrian Pastor is live in the newsroom. Adrian, he's been working more than 20 years to reach his goal. That's exactly right, Zuri. It's actually a remarkable story, one that Jose Oliver says was one only possible through hard work and perseverance. Now, only 6% of American dealerships are minority owned, and that's according to the National Association of Minority Automobile Dealers. And that's a number that he says he wants to see grow. With nothing but $70 in his pocket, a backpack, and a dream, Jose Oliver made his way to the U.S. from the Dominican Republic at just 20 years old. I did almost every job that you can imagine. Landscaping, I worked in restaurants, waited tables, bartending. Before making his way to Vermont, Jose lived in New Hampshire, earning his degree in civil engineering, but wasn't convinced it was the right fit. All it took was a trip to a car dealership to change his mind. Now, nearly 20 years later, Jose is the owner of Oliver Subaru dealership in Rutland. Hard work and dedication and, and being honest and treating people with respect and doing the right things really pay off. It's a sentiment that Jose hopes to continue sharing with his staff in the community as he continues pushing the needle, increasing Latino visibility in Vermont. We've definitely hit the lottery with Jose as our new owner. Having seen the dealership under different ownership, David Brown says he's never had a boss like Jose, calling his journey an American dream fulfilled. He's living proof that it can happen and he he's, he's able to inspire everybody that he talks to. You know, when you when you come in and shake his hand, you know you're talking to a real person. While the goal is to ultimately expand the business, Jose says he's starting small, constructing another waiting area for customers and focusing on giving back. Now that I have gotten here, the objective is to continue to help and, and sort of, you know, push it forward and, and give people opportunities to. He's proof that the American dream is out there. Now, Jose says he looks forward to continuing to serve customers to the best of his ability and hopes to one day become one of the top producing dealerships in New England. Live in the newsroom, Adrian Pastor, NBC5 News.